you need to think so far in advance to keep these cars next to each other. <laughs> Holy shit. Welcome back to Fortune Island. You remember that film, Climb Kana, that Ken Block made in 2017? Why don't we try to recreate it here at Fortune Island? I'm gonna go in make my own race that covers like the best off-road races or the best off-road roads and then go in and recreate climb kana we got all these crazy roads like look at this one it comes all the way up you've got a proper hill climb right there you've got these crazy fast like rally roads over here and then up to the northeast or northwest excuse me you've got this huge cliffside road so uh we need a start point for our race i guess we'll start on the road let's build this crazy crazy racetrack i'm so pumped two hours later and finish line cool we have built the track now we just need to go and build our hoonicorn for this look at my racetracks my racetracks are oh yeah Welcome to this glitch again. We have the Gymkhana 10 Ford Hoonicorn. However, we're not going to use that one. We're going to use this one, the Hoonicorn Mustang. This is the V2 Hoonicorn Mustang, which is the one he actually used. So let's get some better brake. Probably going to be going too fast into a corner. Want to slow down. Rally suspension. That'll be pretty important. Let's also get some weight reduction because, I mean, we're here. Why not? Do we or can we put rally tires on? Yes, we can. Which I think is honestly a very good idea because, I mean, his tires are good, but rally tires are definitely going to be better for our off-roading. And then other than that, we're going to keep it all-wheel drive. Nothing else to change. I'm, I'm legit so excited for this. So, I'm going to give our first attempt a go solo. When we figure out the course, then we'll jump online and have 12 hoonicorns or hoonie trucks all drifting together. I'm also gonna put the AI on the hardest difficulty and then I'm just gonna let them run away off the start because I don't want to deal with them. Uh, why is an AI in a Torque Stallion? That is a mistake and a half. We'll get this thing ready to go for its climb kinda journey. Let's give it a go. We've got rally suspension, rally tires. What could possibly go wrong with this? A 1,400 horsepower Mustang. We got the annoying first corner with the water splash. That's a bit annoying. I wish that wasn't there, honestly, but anyways, let's go. We got this as we climb our sort of kind of very mini Pikes Peak. Holy crap! It actually rallies. I feel like this car might be better with drift suspension because that lack of steering angle is definitely having effect on the way this thing drives. Set season to summer to- Oh dear! Oh guys! Hello! Holy shit! It's Ken Block and friends. That's what this should be called. All right, Ken Block and crash. Swing it out wide! Pull the Ken Block move! Get out of my way, buddy! We gotta swing it wide on the side of the mountain. We gotta shoot the dirt over. Keep it going wide. Oh, that's close to the edge. <laughs> All right, well, let's keep it going. We got to hit this checkpoint before the time expires. Same thing for this one. And we're good. All right, back in the action. Yo, you guys were saying this thing was going to have too much horsepower. The only problem I'm having with it is the steering angle from our rally suspension. All right, well, we've made it down our wannabe pikey peak. And now we get into the very quick rally stage. I think I'm gonna add some impromptu stunts as well, like, you know, Ken Block. Keep chucking it in. Yes! This thing is so cool to drive around. Oh, man. Into our mountain section. Look at the angle. Like, oh, it's so sick. I love this car. This is the one part of the course that, I'll be honest, I'm a little scared about. Because if I do have a problem... This is where it's gonna be because I'm just gonna go flying off the side of the cliff because I'm gonna take a corner way too fast. We get the jump drift. Oh. Okay, now we've got the massive drop and guys are going for overtakes. I do not appreciate that, bro. Holy crap. And now we've got the checkpoints all on the cliff side. We gotta get super close to the edge. That's my goal. Even if you go off, you are so close to death on this road at any point. Oh my god. 
unbelievable. I actually really like the horsepower this thing has. Like, I know you guys were saying the Hooney truck might be better for this because it has less horsepower. I am not running into a single horsepower problem. It's all that drift suspension and then honestly just just gear ratios. That's it. Up oh, what the hell? Look at us go across the line sideways. We've learned some of the problems with the car. We need to go fix the car and then we're going to give this another go because that was sick. That's um yeah. Oh! Yo! Two Forza Edition cars? How the hell? I wasn't even paying attention. That's the best wheel spin I've ever had. Hell yeah. Rally suspension. No bueno. Drift suspension. Or I guess it's called stock suspension technically. But that'll be fine. And then, I mean, our tires were really, really good, honestly. I'll make the gears a tiny bit longer because I noticed I was in second gear a lot of that. Ride height. We need that maxed, please, because we are off-road. We're already super soft. Whoa! The stock suspension for the Hoonicorn is actually really soft. Attempt number two with Hoonicorn V 2.1. Yes, look at that. All right. Hoonicorn V 2.1 is on point. Hell yes. Oh my God. Yeah, I'm happy with this. That's on rally tires. That is ridiculous. Oh my God. It's so fast. I forgot how fast the Hoonicorn was. 120 miles an hour. It's ridiculous. Oh, no. The water's still there. Even in the middle of the summer. Alright, I wanna... I really wanna push this one to the limit. Because I feel so much more comfortable with this car the way it is like now. I wanna get so close to the side. Hey, buddy. Yeah, that is a problem with making a race that goes back on itself. Oh, get super close. Get super close. Yo, that would have looked like the photo. Now we'll run it out wide. Oh, there's a wall there. Can we wall tap the wall? No, no, no. That's a bad place to go for a wall tap because that one's in the way. <laughs> My bad. All right, we got we to gotta rip it though. Super wide. Super duper 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 wide. Holy crap. This car... It's unbelievable how much you can swing it. This is a drift car. It's for hooning. It literally is for hooning about. You don't expect it to work off-road that well. So much fun. All right, well, we made it down to Hill Climb Mountain. Onto the rally section. We need some high speed just because all-wheel drive, yeah. The all-wheel drive allows it to do all of this stuff so nicely. Such a sick car. Now snap it. Super si- That's reverse! <laughs> I didn't realize I was in first gear. Now we go. And there we go. Yes, looking good. Look at the dust. Oh, I love this thing. All right, we gotta go full send into this corner. 150. Send it. <laughs> it's so ridiculous! This is actually ClimbCon. Oh. All right, since we're catching up to the AI, impromptu 360. Off-road. Back onto the road. Not bad. I'll take it. I need to go full send on the cliff section. I want to get so close to the outer limit. I really have no excuse this time to not be able to do it. This car has been amazing. The only thing that is going to let it down is my skill, which is very possible. But I'm going to try to send it. We got to push it all the way to the limit. Oh, my God. I could drive on this road literally all day. Smashing into the fence. That's supposed to keep you on the road. That is how you know you're doing it right. All right, we're going to do some cheeky little tandems, buddy. That's close to the edge. That's really close to the edge. <laughs> I love this track. This is this is the best track in Horizon. Right there. All right, we got to do this on online with a bunch of you guys. I want to see. Okay. <laughs> well, one guy's taking the Hooney truck. There's a Fiesta. There's some there's some new Hoonicorns as well. I have a feeling there's not going to be many sick tandems 
I'll be honest. I see Jack bouncing off the walls. Jack's backwards. He got one. There's DJ right there. Hooning about the Hoonicorn. Look at him go. Dual Hoonicorns. Up our wannabe Pike Peak. You're never going to be able to tandem with these things. Why am I ghosted? Guys, why am I ghost? Okay, finally. Yo, the little Fiesta's sticking with. <laughs> I'm just saying, he's doing pretty good. Sorry, buddy. Coming through. Big boy with 1,400 horsepower. All right, we got DJ and Ace. Yo, DJ's going for the 360. Oh, shit, it worked. Oh, my God, that was so cool. Yo, he's too good at this game. Man, that's incredible. What are we gonna do on the cliff side together? Yo, they actually... I mean, you can try to keep them together. They're just really hard. It's like... You need to think so far in advance to keep these cars next to each other. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, <laughs> it's kind of working. Yo, he has way more confidence than I do. He's legit sliding it everywhere. Like, that was not bad. Oh, I got close to the edge. Oh, no. Oh, I'm gone. And that's what happens. <laughs> when it happens. Called it? Yeah, I think everybody expected me to go off. Not surprised. Jack's like, that did not quite go to plan. 